100% complete. Pitbull Forces Pokemon Card Binder. We got Pokemon cards to open up just in case, but first we gotta build our Pokemon Card Binder and find out. I have a binder for every English Pokemon card set ever released. Going based off the color pattern in the library, the red binder is the one we'll be using today. Our next step is gonna be to grab all the cards from Pokemon Temporal Forces. Now I keep all the reverse hollows in their own pile and I keep all of the double rares or better in their own pile as well. So that leaves all the commons, uncommons, and hollow rare. So we start sorting all of those out by type. Grass with the grass, dragon with the dragon, fire with the fire. Now you'll want to grab a checklist to help you make this process so much faster, not to mention easier too. I'm going to be using the checklist from the Elite Trainer box. There's also plenty of free checklists online, so use whatever one works best for you. In the very back of this booklet is going to be an entire checklist with every Pokemon card, including all the secret rares from this set. And you'll be able to figure out if there's a Psyduck in the set, which unfortunately this time around... Yes. I know, no Psyduck. No Tauros isn't in the set. Now I like to build my binder in numerical order starting with card number one. And for this set, that's gonna be Scyther. Please make sure you leave a spot for any of the double rares. I'm telling you, there's nothing worse than building a binder and forgetting to leave an empty spot. It's like going to Taco Bell and then telling you that they're out of cheese. Cheese, how are you out of... So once you're done putting all the commons, uncommons, and double rares in, it is time for one of my most favorite parts the reverse hollows. I personally like to put in the reverse hollows on top of the regular version. Now, sometimes Pokemon releases different versions of the Pokemon cards in the set. For example, for Alligator in the set, there's only two versions that you can pull from a booster pack, a holo rare and a reverse holo rare. But if you open up a Pokemon Temporal Forces build and battle deck, you can actually pull a non holo for Alligator from that. So if you're someone like me that likes to collect all different versions of the card, Good luck. Sometimes there can even be more versions than that. For example, the Coridon from the set. If you went to GameStop, there is a different hollow foil pattern Coridon available at GameStop with a GameStop logo on it, making a total of four different versions of this card. And yes, I know people are gonna get mad at me, but I put them all in one spot. Go ahead, I'm waiting for the comments. But like I always say, there's no wrong way to build a Pokemon card binder. Whatever makes you happy, that's the way you should go. And then last but not least, we move on to all the illustration rares, the full art special illustration rares, gold cards, and the returning Ace Spec Pokemon cards. And Breaking Family, there we have it. Our official Pokemon Temporal Forces binder has been built. We have not pulled every card, but luckily I have one of every single Temporal Forces item to open up today. Now tell me down in the comments out of all all of these items, which one do you think is going to have the biggest pull? Let's get started. What is up, my breaking family? Sending some positive vibes in your direction. Diving right into today's Pokemon card opening. Hopefully you picked an item that you think is going to have the absolute best pulls. If you're going with the three packs, we're starting off with that. The Kleppa and the Cyclozar. You don't have to pick a specific one, just the type of item. But let's go ahead and start off with the Cyclozar. I am going to be picking the check lane blisters. I'm going with the underdog breaking family, and I believe that's the check lane blisters. I feel like a lot of people pass these up, so that's going to be my pick. We'll open those up very, very last, but we do have the Cyclozar promo, which I do not have in my promo binder for the Scarlet and Violet era, so we are officially adding that into the promo binder as well today. I have a binder, a promo binder for every promo promo era from the English Pokemon TCG. So here is the three packs right here. Let's get started. If you are new here to the channel, this is a series we've been doing for years here on the channel. Uh, the do I have a 100% insert Pokemon card name Pokemon card binder and it is a way for us all to kind of start off our uh, Pokemon binder build to kind of you know together uh, to kind of do it together so this is a series we do every single set every single time a new one comes out so if you enjoy this type of video make sure you give me a nice like on this video or just leave a nice comment either or or nothing <laughs> that's perfectly fine but just letting you know we do it for every single set and uh, it's just always been kind of the name and I got the name basically from a lot of people always asking me years prior I just like hey do you have a 100% uh, complete set of you know whatever XY this or Sun and Moon that and I kind of thought you know that's like a kind of a cool series that we could do and that's how it started we got a Shiftery and 
a Bramble Guest, which I gotta be honest with you, I'm not so sure, Energy put that in the filing cabinet, how I feel about Bramble Guest as a Pokemon, all right? It's just, it's weeds. All right, it's a, it's, that's what it is, okay? Let's just be honest, it's weeds, all right? And and nobody, except for Dandelions, all right? Dandelions, the, they're rock, they're rock and roll, okay? We love Dandelions, but weeds we always remove from the yard, all right? So a Bramble Gas, I'm just not so sure how I feel about that as a Pokemon. It just doesn't seem like so exciting. <laughs> Ooh, a Bramble Gas. <laughs> <laughs> a weed, oh, look at that. How many times have you sat outside and just went, oh, a weed? <laughs> Never, I know, I know. We got a heat more and a gouging fire EX, which breaking fam, like, whoo, that is one that we need for the binder. So that is officially going inside of our temporal forces Pokemon card up binder. Let me go ahead and sleeve it up. Ooh, whoop. Right up there in the VIP section, the very important Pokemon card section, which means we can officially add the VIP ropes with the all you can eat bagel bites. That's right, the all you can eat bagel bites that's always served in the VIP section. Sausage, pepper, any combination. E oh, ease. Ease is not cheese. <laughs> Let me try it again. That's right, bagel bites that's always served in the VIP section. Sausage, pepper, any combination. Cheese, that's it. That's all, nothing else. Grab yourself a paper plate, <laughs> your VIP as well. We always try to see if I can make it through that without stumbling over my words, and it's hard. It's hard to do it fast like that, like Sonic the Hedgehog speed fast, we're talking. And here is our next three pack, and this one is going to a Kleppa, and we do not have Kleppa in our promo binder yet either, so that is officially being added in, and that is adorable that we're actually getting a baby Pokemon as a promo. I mean, that's really, really neat because we don't see baby Pokemon a whole lot get printed as cards. So it's a neat, you know, when you can have easy access like that to getting a baby Pokemon card. Go let, if, uh, if Cleffa is one of your favorites, then maybe you should think about Psyduck. Psyduck's a really, really awesome Pokemon that you should think about as being your most favorite, and then, you know, Cleffa as your second favorite. We got Rescue Board, Sharpedo, is it? It's not Shark Week yet. I think that's like July, isn't it? Sizor Scizor, never run with a Sizor Scizor, all right? Always gotta be careful. I always had these, uh, whoop, when I was, uh, when I was younger, I had these like Mickey Mouse, uh, like little plastic scissors that I always used, and it had my name on them. I think I used them for kindergarten, and I still have them to this day, all right? I don't know why I've never gotten rid of them, but uh, it's just, it's something my mom bought me. She wrote my name on it. It's her handwriting, and I've just never thrown them away. I don't know why. It's just, it's I'm sentimental with things like that. And a Mel Metal Energy put in the filing cabinet. I cannot be the only person out there that has a hard time throwing random things like that away. I, I, okay, here's the thing. I have a problem where what I, I, what I do, and I, I feel like there's a name for this, but an animate object, I think that's how you pronounce it. Like, you know, a bottle of water or a pen, you almost kind of like give it a personality and you feel like it has feelings. And I feel like everything has feelings and I never want to hurt anybody's feelings. Fly away, bird, except for that bird. We got Rosalia. Oh. Oh, that's a good one, Breaky family. We got the full our Iron Leaves EX. And if you don't know, literally one of the most playable cards from the set is the Iron Leaves EX. And the fact that we just got the full art for the binder is a huge deal, Breaking family. If I can get my sleeves. Oh, this is good. Whoop. Oh, that is so nice. Right up there in the VIP section. Looking good. If you pick the three packs, you might be winning. But maybe you were somebody that decided to go with the Elite Trainer boxes because, well, there is more packs inside of them than a three pack. So math-wise, I feel like that makes sense. And I'm not good at math, all right? That's the thing. Energy, put that in the filing cabinet right over there. I'm not good at math. Uh-oh. We got, uh, we're stuck in the math hole. We're stuck in the math hole. Hang on. Hang on. I think we can get out of this. Ugh. Hang on. Ugh. There is the sleeves right there. We already have the promo inside of the binder because we have opened up the Elite Trainer boxes previously. So I do not need to add another one. But if you did pick the Elite Trainer box, good choice. I mean, there's literally nine packs inside of it, so it makes sense that 
Maybe a big hit would be from inside an Elite Trainer box, but there's only one way to find out, right? Breaking Family, we gotta figure out what is inside of this Elite Trainer box. And first pack in, very first Pokemon pack opening from the Elite Trainer box, we already have a Walking Awake EX Double Rare. Now, I already have this for the binder, but I love sparkly. I love sparkly, I love glittery, and I'll never complain about pulling a Double Rare. Whoop! Right up there in the VIP section. I don't care what the price or value of this double rare is right here. I pulled a double rare. That's exciting. That's exciting. I remember I remember being a kid and being excited about pulling a hollow rare. So the fact that I get to pull a double rare now, I mean, that's exciting to me. I know it's not exciting to everybody, but for me, I think that's fun. I think that's a big deal. I don't care what the value is on that. I just love to open up Pokemon cards. I love to open them up. I love to collect. It's a good time. Iron Treads right there. Right there. <laughs> right there. Energy put in the filing cabinet. I always say it's about the memories. Breaking Family, it's about the memories and the, the memories that you have attached to things, the, the, uh, the feelings, the emotions that things make you feel when you see them. Like, I'll, I might see this Temporal Forces binder 10 years from now, right? and have so many memories attached to it, and you cannot place a value on any of those memories. So, I mean, memories, that's what I'm all about. That's what I'm all about here on this channel. Energy, put in the filing cabinet, just having a good time, having fun, making some memories, creating some memories. You know, memories with you all, the, the community. We got a Noctowl, which is a bird, not a marsupial. And it'd be rude to tell a bird just sit there and not spread its wings and fly away, bird. Fly away, go be a bird, be yourself, all right? Be you, always be yourself, all right? Don't try to be like anybody else. Be you just the way you are, all right? You're amazing, beautiful, wonderful just the way you are. There's only one of you in this world. Never forget that. I'm talking to you. Yeah, you. Yeah, you. I'm talking to you. Fly away. We got Machang and a... Another walking wake. All right, we'll take it. We'll take it. All right. I won't complain about a double, all right? It's a double rare after all. It makes sense, double rare. You pull two of them, whoop. You know what I will complain about though? Is when I go to Taco Bell and they're like, hey, we're all out of cheese. <laughs> this has happened to me way more times than I would really like it to. And I don't eat at Taco Bell a crazy amount, okay? I don't want you thinking that I'm going to Taco Bell every single day because I don't, but I feel like more times, more times as of the past year, two years, that we went to Taco Bell and uh, they'll be like, hey, we're out of cheese, meat, lettuce, cheese. I feel like that's the, I feel like that's Taco Bell's three primary colors, <laughs> right? Which is red, blue, yellow. Is that the, oh, is that the three primary colors? I believe that is. Red, blue, yellow. I think that's it. I think that's it. But it's like Taco Bell's primary colors, right? So it's like, you're out of cheese, really? I don't know. I just get so baffled by it. Oh, speaking of baffled, what about a bramble gas? A, a baffled bramble gas. Say that five times fast. Baffled bramble gas. Baff, baffled bramble gas. Baffled. Baffled bramble gas. Baffled bramble gas. Baffled bramble gas. Baffled. Bramble gas, baffled bram okay, I tried. Lick it tongue. We got Slugma. Scream tail. Heavy baton. Ooh, so heavy. And a Drampa looks like Falcor from Never Ending Story, which is streaming somewhere on the 5,632 streaming platforms somewhere. But if you've never seen the Never Ending Story, you gotta see it. It's like a classic 80s movie, very like fantasy type of vibes. If you've ever seen Labyrinth, kind of like along the same vibes as that, which Labyrinth, my favorite movie of all time, has got David Bowie in it. Bronzor and a Roaring Moon. Energy put in the filing cabinet. One pack left from this Elite Trainer Box Breaking Family. Two Walking Wakes. It's not looking good if you picked the Elite Trainer Box. That's all I'm saying. If you picked the three pack, you're still in the lead. You're absolutely still in the lead. We got Electabuzz. Whew. Electabuzz is always throwing those punches. Mist Energy. Mighty Inna. And a da dun sparse oh breaking family. I'm not complaining about pulling those, but comparing it to the three pack, 
you're like, man, I guess I'll just go with three packs rather than elite trainer boxes and uh, buy more three packs than, than I will an elite trainer box because you can buy what? Three, three, three packs or two, three packs for the price of uh, one elite trainer box. Just something to think about, right? I mean, this right here could redeem itself, you know? Like, not every Elite Trainer box is like a guaranteed, oh, you're supposed to pull this and this and this. No, it's literally all random. I might have not even pulled those two walking weights. So anything is possible when it comes to the Elite Trainer box. I think that's a big misconception that a lot of people have, um, is that a lot of people think that you're supposed to pull a certain amount or a certain number of rarities uh, from an elite trainer box and you're not there, there's literally no guarantee when it comes to an elite trainer box as somebody who's been opening up pokemon cards since base set energy i promise you there's no guarantee of what you're supposed to get in there it'd be nice it would be nice i think we would uh, all end up buying a lot more elite trainer boxes if it was like guaranteed gold card inside of one of the packs but unfortunately it is not we got vigable latius great tusk bronzong and a mag cargo for the rare energy in that one. Hollow rare to be more specific. All right. Pack number three. Yeah, pack number three. We got Roly Coley, Heatmore, Yamper, such an adorable little pupper, Torret Cat, Heavy ugh, Baton. We got Mist Energy. Oh, oh, we got the kitty cat right there going to a Litten and a Maridon, which is good. Which is good. We'll take him a ride on. But that Litten, oh, the, the first illustration rare of today's Pokemon card opening. Oh, so nice. It's almost like, it's almost like um, the view of this card is like a camera, right? Not like a, a camera that you take pictures with, but, you know, like one of the security cameras, right? Whoop. Oh, my goodness. Look at all the, look at the, there's only one Litten. But it's somebody who is a big fan of Litten because you can see all the memorabilia right there on the shelf. And I believe there's another Litten. So two Littens right there. Oh, we needed that one for the binder breaking family. That's good. That's good. I'll absolutely take a Litten in my life. Back to back Litten. Is that a good sign? I don't know. I'm more of a dog person myself. I mean, if you've never seen our dog, we have a little dog named Evie. Looks like a shiny Evie. I love her so much. I love her so much. Back to back. Breaking family. This is what I'm talking about. Because the elite trainer boxes can literally be all over the place. And we have an Excadrill right here and a Melmetal. Sorry, Melmetal. Spotlight has been stolen. But literally two illustrations back to back inside of this elite trainer box. Whereas the last one, we just literally pulled two Walking Wake double rares. So anything is possible. Whoop. Five packs left from the Elite Trainer Box, and then I think, I think we're gonna go into the Booster Bundle next, which I feel like I never have good luck with the Booster Bundle. For me, I feel like they're always very, very rough, but could be wrong this time. Could absolutely be wrong. And yes, if you are wondering, we do try to get every Reverse Hollow as well for the binder. So I try to get every version of every card. So, you know, with the library back there, we're trying to document on video with pictures on social media, video here on the channel of getting every English Pokemon card ever made, promos, sets, whatever, trying to document the entire process. I'm pretty sure I've never seen this done before on the internet, documenting the entire process. Oh, the Gengar EX, nice energy. But that's what we're doing here on the channel, so make sure you hit subscribe, become part of the Breaking Family. Whoop! A nice positive community we have here on the channel where we leave the negativity at the door. There's enough negativity in the world. Why would we add more to it? We don't. We don't. We just want to hang out and have a good time, right? There's enough negativity going on. Let's take a few moments out of the day to just enjoy each other's company, all right, in a positive environment where I always say, you're welcome. You're welcome here anytime, any day of the week. But one, one catch gotta be you gotta be yourself while you're here okay palafin all while the mall while and a roaring moon even if even if you don't like me that's good that's all good i still like you all right i still like you still think you're awesome and you're welcome here as well all right 
even if you don't like me. That's perfectly okay. All right? A little saying that I learned a couple years ago, you can be the sweetest peach on a peach tree. Energy! But some people just don't like peaches. Peaches, peaches, peaches. I literally heard that saying a couple years ago, and I, like, it changed. <laughs> it changed my life, all right? I'm telling you. I went through this some sort of portal whoosh, swooshing around in this portal after I heard this saying, and I came out the other side, and I was like, my life is changed after I heard this saying. And I don't know why it stuck with me, but it just made so much sense, all right? It just made so much sense. And I see an ace spec right there. And sometimes things like that in life capture your attention. Saw's Buck and a Maximum Belt, which is one of the very playable ace spec cards. We do already have one, though, but I can put it in my trade binder and trade it off. We got a Feraligator Energy put it in the filing cabinet. Now, it appears that they have changed the look of the booster bundles. It's a, more of a rectangle than it is like a cube. It's really, really interesting. So I got this at GameStop. I don't know, I feel like it's more eye-catching on the shelf, and they can probably put more on the shelf by going this route right here. But there is six packs inside. That's all you get if you're somebody that's literally just looking for packs. This is the best route to go for you, probably. Cost-wise and getting the most amount of packs, this is the way that you want to go. Go with this one. We got a cutie fly, not a bird. That one That one is not supposed to fly away. We got a ponyta going into a sableye. And, oh, I feel like, oh, 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 going into a Raging Bull EX Full Art. I take it all back, Breaking Family. I take it all back. The booster bundle has been good to me for once. Oh, oh my goodness. Whoop. Right up there in the VIP section. No, it's not yours. It's not. It, well, just because you said booster bundle at the start does not mean that, that you get that. That's not what it means, no. I'm, I'm actually gonna give it to you. I'm actually gonna give it to you, right? It's gonna be yours, I'll give it to you afterwards. You can have it as part of your collection, all right? Oh, what, you, now you don't want it? Now we still have five booster packs left from the booster bundle. Then we have uh, one each artwork of the single packs, and then we're going into the check lane blisters, which were my pick for the biggest pull of today's entire Pokemon card opening. And if you have been pulling some fire from Temporal Forces or another set, or you picked up a really neat Pokemon item, I would love to see it. Tag me on social media. I want to see some of your fire pulls, some of some cool things inside of your collection. All my social media is down in the video description. Post some of those pictures. Tag me in it. I want to see some of your neat stuff that you're getting. We got Ekans wrapped around a tree. And this is my, this literally, this year, 2024, is my 10-year anniversary of creating content. That's right, my 10-year anniversary of creating Pokemon content here on YouTube. And uh, it'd be nice to see some of your stuff, all right? You get to see a lot of a lot of my stuff, what goes here on the channel, but I'd love to see some of your stuff. But this year, we got a lot of big things planned this year to celebrate 10 years. We've already been celebrating some of it throughout the entire year, so far the entire year. But the rest of the year, we still have more planned, including... A very big trip that I'm taking you all on very, very soon. Like, very soon. Like, very, very soon uh, that you're not going to want to miss. So turn on your notifications. It's a place that I've taken you all before here on this channel. I've been there before. I can't drive there. Energy. I can't, uh, I can't ride a horse there. I can't take a train there. Probably... Probably could swim. It, oh, man. That'd be a rough one. That'd be a rough one. But I, I, I could swim it if I really had to. I don't want to, but if I really had to, I could. I don't think I could, but you know what I'm saying. Anyways, it's it's big. It's happening. A few videos from that location. It's going to pop up here on the channel very, very soon. And another walking wake. We almost have a play set. Breaking Family, one more, and we have an entire playset, but we have some big things planned for that trip that you're going to want to not miss. Whoop! Right here on the channel. Let's go to one of each of the pack artwork. So if you picked 
if you pick the booster bundle, I don't know, would you consider yourself winning? Would it? Would you consider yourself winning? Man, that's a hard one. I gotta be honest with you, it's hard. That iron leaves, that full art iron leaves, that's a big one. I mean, the playability and it's a full art, that's huge. That's huge. So, we got a Shroomish, Golurk, Shaman. Oh, 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 wait a minute. Wait a minute. Breaking family going into the, how would you say it? Eerie? Eerie? Eerie, Drampa, I like to say Eerie, Eerie, Indiana. You remember that TV show way back in the day? I was always so excited because it had Indiana in the name and that's where I'm from. And I was like, finally a TV show with Indiana in the name. Oh. <laughs> it was made by R.L. Stein, the same, same, uh, same dude that made Goosebumps. Oh, that is nice. Special illustration right there. Woo, Lucario in the background. We got the Toxicroak. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. If you pick the single packs, I think you're winning. I I think you're winning, okay? Uh, single packs or three packs? I, either or, I think that beats the Elite Trainer Box and the Booster Bundle, unfortunately, if you picked either of those. Screamtail going into... Do we really, do we really have another full art? Going into another Raging Bull EX Full Art. What is going on right now? The single packs are on fire. We have literally, we have two more left. Can we go four for four on this? All right, we gotta go four for four. Here we go. Do you believe in me? All right, that's the answer I expected. No, all right. Sida, thank you so much for being here, buddy. Slowpoke, you as well, my friend. Ugh. This is good. Nope, we're not opening up Lost Thunder. Sun and Moon Air is over. Yeah, we're on to Scarlet and Violet now. No, that's right. You can join. You can join. All right. Three for three. Do we got three for three on the single packs? Oh, I forgot to sleeve that up, too. We got... Oh, I got one of those in my background, if you can spot it. We got Meltan, Dot, Great Tusk. All right, come on. Let's back to back. Let's go three for three on this. Breloom. And a De Dunsparce ruining the party. Of course it is. Let's go ahead and sleeve up the Raging Bolt. That'll end up going in my whoop, trade binder for when I go to Pokemon League next. All right, last one from the single packs. We can still go three for three, though. Still could go three for three. Here we go. We got Bramblin, Girafferig, Cutie Fly. Oh, such a cutie. Shaman. Cypher Maniacs code breaking. I'm telling you, it's a hard one. It's a hard one to say without stumbling there. And a mag cargo. We literally pulled the best two right at the very start right there. I don't know. The single packs might be winning. We do have. We do have the check lane blisters. Hang on. They're around here somewhere. Oh, here we go. There it is, the check lane blisters. Let's start off with the Carvana. Ooh, na na, which I love the artwork on this because you can see the sun shining down and kind of uh, reflecting off the top of Carvana. Oh, it's such a good one. It's such a good one. And we have to officially add this into the promo binder as well because this is the first time I'm opening up one of these check lane blisters. Carvana going in the promo binder. I'm going to put that right back there. Let's go ahead and open up that booster pack. Remember, this was my pick right here. This was... Don't, don't say that I'm not going to pull anything. I wouldn't say that about your packs. No, I'm not going to be mean to you. No, I know what you're trying to do. I'm not going to... Yeah, I'm not going to fall for it. You're right. You're right. We got Snow, Mudbray. So you're trying to be mean to me. Think I'll be mean back to you. There's never any circle of rudeness. I'm not falling for it. No, 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 no. Latius, Great Tusk. Ponyta, and another Mag Cargo. Energy, put it in the filing cabinet. I hear the laughs. I Yeah, I hear them. And a Belly Bolt, making Iono proud. Now, I don't have this one for the promo binder either. So, this is officially being added to the promo binder. That Belly Bolt goodness. Very, very awesome promo. They did really nice with the uh, the promos on the check lane blisters this time. You know, let's do a quick rundown of everything that we got before we open up our last pack. Wow, that went fast breaking, family. Raging Bolt, 
We got Erie, Indiana right there. Waking walk or walking what? Walking wake. <laughs> Have I been saying, been saying waking walk the entire time? Walking wake. Another raging bolt. Maximum belt. I'm all over the place. I know it. All right. That's just who I am. I'm not going to apologize for being myself. Excadrill. We got Litten Illustration Rare. Another walking wake. Another walking wake. Iron Leaves, Full Art, Sizor, Scizor, and Gouging Fire. So we 100% got some Pokemon cards today that we needed for our Pokemon card binder. Our Pokemon binder, it's getting big. It's getting big, Breaking Family. Hopefully, hopefully you have some nice luck with your Pokemon card openings as well. It's always a good time when opening Pokemon cards together like we did today. We got Ekans, Turtwig. Poochiana, wishing you all the best of luck on your very next pack opening. So whatever your very next pack opening is, post it on social media. Tag me so I can see what it is. See if I can see if I brought you some good luck. Bolton, Mudsdale, Reverse Hollow Maridon, and Breaking Family. We are ending on. Can I get a drum roll, please? Thank you. You know I appreciate you always being here too. No. You rock, you rock, all right? You write me a lot of Travis Barker, all right? Oh, inspiration of yours, okay. Right. Blink-182, my favorite band, so I'm right there with you. Rivers Ellen right on, and Breaking Family, we are ending on. Frostmoth and Relicanth, you ruined the party! Breaking Family, that's it for today's Pokemon video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check out the rest of the videos right over there. We'll see you all in the next video and don't forget i love every single one of you all around the world do it with me now peace love and a high five